I want to see it. Make sure it get both of us. Yeah, mine's gonna get both of us, bro. So it could get it just catch you. Hey, Sean, you a genius, nigga. What's up, guys? Welcome back to another episode. It's your boy, Abby. Motherfucking Cuban. This your boy, I am X Good, and we back at it again with another vid, man. Hell yeah, hell yeah. I know, uh, guys, I know we're kind of been, I've been lagging on, it's been laggy on the episodes we drop. Like, it's not every Sunday. We've been, uh, it's been like every other week or some shit. Yeah, we're gonna try to stay a little bit more consistent yeah, yeah. with it. Hold on. Hold on, guys. Yo, 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 yo. I feel like you can't really hear me. Can you? Yeah, I can I hear. hear well, I mean, in my headphones, I like it sounds like a kind of far. Nah, you straight, bro. It's probably because I turned it down a little bit. But all right, let's get this going, bro. What you gonna drink today? Uh, I'm gonna start off with some douce. Douce. I think I'm gonna go back to that shit was fucking fire. It was fire. Time. I'm gonna go back with the uh, some Buffalo Trace. Hopefully, I'm gonna, I'm gonna hopefully. keep it black on the day. Hopefully, like I'm. I'm gonna shout out Jay. Shout out Jay. Oh. <laughs> yeah, <who the> <laughs> <is that? laughs> All right. All right. Let me pop my beard too. Oh, shit. I was like, man, that shit not cold. Hopefully, uh, I don't know if on TikTok, I mean on Instagram, I mean Facebook Live, you can drink, but we'll know. find out today. Yeah, I don't know if on Instagram Live. I think you, you can. can. I think you can. If you can, let me know down in down in the, the comments. comments let yeah. Me know. Let me know. This is my first time going live. This is like my first time going live. Damn, you can see. Let me cross my legs. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like the angle because you can actually see my. <laughs> Damn, I think I'm gonna just have to go back to here. Nobody's in here anyway, so. Okay, I'm gonna have to just be a gentleman and cross my legs. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. Cheers, brother. Cheers, brother. I haven't had Buffalo Trace in forever. I know that's that used to be my go-to right there, man. This is all right, man. For everybody that's on Instagram Live, hey, yep. We're gonna do the question of the week. Be be feel free to uh to comment what y'all wanna what y'all wanna comment about, especially on um especially on uh the question of the week because we really want we really want y'all to Hold get on. into. Do you with hear that? that? Yeah, it's kind of like an echo sound. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you feel that? Yeah, I can't. I don't know if it's a. All right, we're gonna. It's gonna probably mess up right now, but. All again. Yo 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 yo. It's a, right. yeah. It's a I think bit I think I think I think we're solid. I think we're solid. Yeah. But. What's up, man? How you been? Shit, it's been the past past couple weeks, man. It's been a it's been real festive, man. Mm-hmm. Been uh, getting into a lot of things as far as um getting getting things for my house. You got as a far, house? No. Oh, I was <laughs> like getting like I was, oh, you got a house? I was nah, like, nigga, nigga get like, congrats. <laughs> getting like new furniture, getting shit okay, hung up okay. on the walls, man. Just more family pictures and shit like that. So okay, there it goes again, bro. Damn, man. Yeah. That's why I hate moving shit. Like these two. Oh yeah. Yo yo. All right. Hopefully that that works. Oh yeah. That was all the mics plugged in, huh? Yeah. Turn that down. Turn that down. Right. Yo, I think because I think it's the the headphones. On this one. Like well, like you could because you could hear. Mm-hmm. On those. Oh yeah. So it just completely. Yeah. Empty. Yeah. Okay. I think we should be solid. Uh, how's, the, how's the past couple of weeks been? Shit, man, you, man, it's been crazy. We had a baby shower for my sister-in-law. I know. Um, shout out to Tina. Yeah, shout out to Tina. Having a baby boy. Mm-hmm. And then today, bro, like, I was supposed to wash my car, but then I was like, I, wa- I opened the garage, and I was like, we have to clean this garage. Bro, how the fuck, how, how do you clean your garage in apartments? I mean, how do you clean your car in an in a apartment? No, no, I went to my in-laws. Oh, I'm about to say, nigga, I'm trying to. <laughs> nah, I went to I'm, my in-laws. I have paying. everything over there. I have, like, the power washer and everything. Oh, okay. So I go over there, and, and the reason why I, I do it, because I don't go to a car wash, because I have a light bar, mm-hmm. and you can't take it. I can't take it into the car wash, because... I guess it will get stuck and some shit, but it is what it is, man. It is what it is. But 
uh, so I was gonna wash my car today because it looks like shit. Because mm-hmm. we went shooting. Shout out to Juan. Damn, I should wear his his hat. Shout out to Juan. Um, he took a shooting a couple weeks ago, and we went and we went off roading. So my car's all fucked up. Mm. The inside is even worse, bro. Oh yeah. Yeah, I'm bad. <laughs> I'm bad. <laughs> I mean, you take yeah, you take the jeep. Yeah. Damn, that would have been nice to do, man. I ain't never been off roading. I like. The um, I'm I'm thinking in two weeks. We're gonna go shoot it again if mm-hmm. you want to come. Oh yeah, I'm with it. Yeah, I think I'm in two weeks on Sunday. Okay, and then we could come back and shoot a podcast and talk about how we did. Yeah, and show our good. posters. I have the poster that I shot up in the car, mm-hmm. and I said I'm gonna hang it up. But I was like, where the fuck am I gonna hang it up? Maybe over there, because that wall's kind of plain. Yeah, that'd be dope. So yeah, um, actually, man, I got I got a few more paintings that I want to put up in here, man. But so we can. The, yeah, it's like it's not a lot of room though. You know, know what I'm saying. Uh, when I get rid of the small ribs house, then it will be better. But but I got a picture of Sade, man. That's like, oh my god, one of my favorite all time female I mean, artists. It could, is it like? Can it go up there? Nah, it's it's the same. Oh, it's the same it's size. The same size as these. What about right there? Yeah. Most, yeah. Huh? Yeah. Maybe yeah, like you can't really see it, but yeah. if we put it over there, you, we won't be able to see it either. Yeah. So yeah. that's why we, when we get our studio, man, make sure make sure y'all tap in. We're gonna yeah. have all type of shit. Yeah. Hopefully soon. Yeah, that's we're in the good. works. We works. We're in the works with somebody right now, and I think it's gonna be good because he wants to start his podcast. So it's gonna be like a half and half thing, mm-hmm. and we can hook it up. We could do everything on and bring more guests, females. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man, Fem- females is always welcome, man. Yeah, yeah. Uh, well, kind of. <laughs> you have to you have to talk to my wife. Yeah, know? you got to talk to both of the misses. Yeah, and then and then you know if they said that you can not explain that, nah, nah, nah. Uh, <laughs> nah. But it will be more. I feel like it will be more respectful. You feel me? Like I can't like bringing girls over and then bringing them in a the room in front of my girls. I understand where she's coming from, but yeah. you know if she don't trust me, she could come in the room and do the podcast with me. So, <laughs> nah. But um, uh, I was gonna ask you uh, because me and Lydia was watching uh. A series like a week ago. Um, you have Hulu, yeah. So tonight, yeah, you, you have Hulu Life or no? Yeah. Okay, so tonight they, you know that 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 show Bar Rescues. I heard of it. I haven't. So go, they're going. They have an episode here in Mobile. Really? Yeah. What bar? Uh, Papa John's. What the fuck? Yeah. Papa, J- that old ass one by Farmer Boy. Yeah. On fucking Frederick. Yeah. Oh, fuck no. Yeah, bro. <laughs> that shit old as fuck. Yeah. <laughs> Damn. So, uh, so go, go, go. It's tonight at ten. Uh huh. So go check it out. Damn, I'm like, me and Lydia was like, oh, when is it? Cause we, cause the whole, cause everybody at work goes there, and I'm like, I don't. Uh-huh. First of all, like, I don't fuck with Papa John's though. It's not Papa John's no more. Something else. Oh, uh, what is? It's like it's a. It's, it's I don't know. It's, it's the same bar. place, but it's just not Papa John's no more. But I for. <laughs> I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna talk shit before I watch the podcast. I mean, for, before I watch the episode, but. Uh huh. I don't know if, if like the contract would say like, oh, after we done shooting, we're taking everything back. You know, like everything yeah. we gonna re, we, we gonna take everything they put in it because what went I'm like for a bar that was on a TV show, uh-huh. like bar rescues because kind it's kind of big. It looks like shit. Yeah, the bathrooms, bro. <laughs> it's bro, you you, you can like you didn't want to go pee. Nasty. You feel like you about to go yes, you about to get stabbed because you go you go through a dark room before you go through the fucking bathroom. Right. So I'm like, uh, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I can't do shit like that, bro. That's some that's some weirdo shit right there. I mean, t- if it's a decent bar, but the only reason why like I don't really go on that side, because uh-huh. it's just right like. Kind of an enemy. Yeah, I'm not gonna say enemy. It's it's in the opposite side where we grew up. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Even that. though the the no north side is out there, but still, like it just yeah, you got that's other territory. yeah. So it's it's all, but that's why I don't like really going up there. But so my my coworkers, how like, come like what's going? I was out for show, so I'm like oh, I want to see it because I, you know it was all over Martin Valley my matters and shit. Like oh, this bar is gonna be on on bar rescue. Yeah, woo woo woo. So I'm like, all right, cool. We pull up, and I'm like. This is what it looked like. I said, so did they make a contract where like when the show's over, they just take back everything they fucking put into? So, but I haven't seen that. I, I didn't see, I haven't, I never been to Papa John's. Yeah, me neither. Never. Like I never see what it, what it, 
what it looked like. I don't know. Like, so when I see the episode today, I'm like, okay, kind of upgraded or whatever. Yeah. But what pissed me off is they ran out of idol fives too. So I know. If I, damn. They ran out of 805. You know what? You know who got a bomb ass 805 and it comes straight out the tap? Fucking smoking fire by my house. Smoking fire. Smoking fire is fire. Smoking fire? Yeah. Where's that at? It's like, it's, it's on central. It's like down the hill from my house. Like I said, smoke. Is that a barbecue spot? Yeah, low key. Yeah, they got. Okay, a bar- I think they I know a, what you're talking about. They got a barbecue rib sandwich with mac and cheese on that motherfucker. I think I know what you're talking about. Fire, bro! It's not like a little plaza. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I know what you're talking That's about. That's right where that uh that Ralph's is at. Yeah, yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. I've been there. Yeah, though, that shit is fire. Me and Lily didn't like it. You didn't like? It? No. What? Yeah. Oh, me and my girl loved it. Bro. Yeah, we didn't really like it. Uh, Damn. And but, they got a little uh, Mexican food spot right there too. That shit's fire. Too. On the same spot, like in like yeah, a different location though. Uh, in the same same area. Oh, okay. I thought you mean like in the restaurant. Like it's like a barbecue and Mexican spot. Mm-mm. That'd be kind of good though. Kind of sided with barbecue sauce. Oh fuck! Never know. I had it before. I tried you had that? that? Hell yeah! I tried it before, but Ooh. when my when I was uh, making corn asada before. You I just, just threw some barbecue sauce on that bitch. That's just so good. Hell yeah. Ooh, like like barbecue, like kind of side of barbecue tacos. <laughs> Damn, I ain't never even thought of that shit. <laughs> that just sounds fire as fuck. Well, hey, by the way, how was your four twenty? My four twenty, man. Shit, you already know I got faded, but you know I can't let my girl know that shit. But uh, is she watching? <laughs> no. Oh, okay. Well, she's gonna watch the fuck. <laughs> she's gonna watch you're, it. You're fucked anyway. I'm fucked. But nah, uh, you know I, I blaze one real quick. You know, make sure I send it out to all the dead homies mm-hmm. who couldn't smoke with me that in that evening. But you know, oh yeah. Yeah, my 420 was pretty festive, man. How was yours? It was great. Yeah. It was so great. Yeah, you said it sounded like you had more a better shot than I did. Man. I want What'd you do? <laughs> I always put Lily on blast, but <laughs> she got faded. <laughs> she got faded, but I think like we turns were on or something. Oh yeah. I think so. Damn. That was great. <laughs> Bro, I would like but I, I smoke. You see that little the one right there in that half? Yeah. So we smoked. We, uh, me and my homegirl Jackie, we smoked the same the, the same one, right? Uh huh. But I was like, I'm not. I don't. I don't like blazing it when my baby's up. So like when she goes sleeping, well, alright, let's let's blaze it. Uh-huh. So she was up. She was taking a nap. So I said, you guys go ahead and do that shit. I'll do it like when she when she when I put her to bed for the night. Yeah. So I for sure. So boom, um, put her the baby to sleep. And I thought she finished the other one. So I came and grabbed that one. Uh-huh. And uh, but she left like maybe like this much left. Right. And uh, I started hitting it, boom, boom. And I was like, I'm about to turn the other one on. Bro, I took like two hits. And then, you know how, my, you know Eric, right? Eric, the okay. guy with the 99 lives. Oh, yeah, yeah. So that motherfucker knows everything. So he tells me, you're not going to fill it into seven minutes after you hit your first hit. What the fuck? So I was like, okay. So boom. I was like, I, that's what he, that's what I guess the, 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 the steady was like when you, when you blaze, mm-hmm. like your first hit is going to hit you seven minutes after later. Right. So I'm like, all right, boom, boom. I hit like, do, do, do. I hit it back to back. It was only being myself because Lydia was already yeah, calm. she already faded. So I was like, all right, so I'm doing it by myself. When I hit, like, when my when I was like down to the last bit, I was like, <sighs> took a big old hit. And I was like, hold it, hold it, hold it. And then like, when I let it go, I was like, my eyes just went, ooh. <laughs> but I was like, well, I couldn't keep my eyes open. I was like. Shit felt heavy. I was like, oh. And then we'll start watching the 85 Side Show. But. That shit was the funniest thing in the world <laughs> high, bro. So I'm like cracking the fuck up. And I look at her and she was like, what? And I was like, I'm so fucking high. And so then like I, I hopped in the shower and then, you know, mm-hmm. we did what we got to do. But yeah. See, that's man. I'm glad you can. Well, but I think you I think you could get shit. your girl like to do it. You know, just have her like, hey, just try it with me. Nah. Like, come on, let's try it. I tried it. I tried it. She won't do it. She will not let up, bro. Because she just think it's. it's she just think it's a bad drug just because she she she, she just grew up. And shit. Yeah, she just grew up off that fucking mentality that that shit is just like it fucks with your brain, makes you stupid. But I'm just like, babe, I'm from a little bit. Yeah, it kills some of your brain cells. <laughs> <laughs> but you I'm know, like, we don't do it all the time. I'm like, babe, I'm from California. Like that shit is just it's introduced to yep. us at a young age, so we can't really help it. But you know. Motherfuckers, it's a gateway drug to certain motherfuckers who. But are. that's only if you. I feel like when people say that, I don't. I don't agree with it. They don't I feel like it's a gateway drug if you you have addicted addicted addictive addictive 
a per- personality. Right. So if you get addicted fasting, okay, boom, and you don't see that no more. Mm-hmm. I don't feel like I'm like, well, me personally, I mean, I tried cocaine and I tried other shit mm-hmm. and I didn't like them. I didn't like the feel of it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I like weed because it keeps me like, I'm still present, but I'm still like. Yeah, you're in a different so, mindset though. The Loki, I want to try shrooms. Oh, I did shrooms, bro. How was that? It's it's a it's a different type of high. It's a high that it's a high that you have to you have to clear your schedule. You can't you can't be doing shit yeah, at all, bro. Chill. I was at the beach, thank God, and I was just zoned out. So I felt like I was on cloud nine. So I wasn't doing shit. But if you if you if you have some if you have errands to run, yeah, <laughs> don't run them, bro. You you got to put that shit on hold because that shit okay. have your ass fucked up. So right. nobody was on my live, so we're gonna go on on Instagram live for the podcast. Mm-hmm. So, but yeah, I want to try it because I heard uh, shrooms are pretty like they're really good. They're they're like a like the the what is it called? Hold on, guys, my bad, my bad. I'm just trying to trying to get this going. All right, let's get it. How many people we got in there? But all right, where we at? So, bro, my piece. You can see my little <laughs> my two my my two inch. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I got more nuts than, than balls, though. No, I didn't. <laughs> I got more nuts than balls. <laughs> I so know, you, right? <laughs> you, see, you, you see my nuts more. Um, man, this shit. This this wild turkey sitting. I mean, not wild turkey. Um. Buffalo Trace. Right, there we go. All right, but so I was gonna ask you. So we're talking about four twenty. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I was gonna ask you something else, but never mind. I, no, the, I question, lost. the question of the week last week. Question of the week. Uh, we had so we had a podcast last week, mm-hmm. and so some reason for some reason I don't know why every time I record that camera is not focused. Right. So I have to make sure like it's focused, but it doesn't let me know there. But when I put it on the computer, it's like, boom, like now That's you it. can't even see us. Nigga, it's just blurry. <laughs> so, so I was editing the podcast and it was just going back, back and forth between me and you. Right. And I could have threw it up like that, but it was just like, like, and I'm like, I don't like that shit. Yeah. So last, last question, last, uh, question of the week was what's the red flag for you? A red flag. Yeah. What's the red flag with me? And, I don't even remember what the fuck I said, bro. <laughs> I don't remember what the fuck I said either. I think you said. I think you said you're not. Oh, nigga <laughs> 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 must be hungry. <laughs> I just ate. <laughs> I hope this shit catches it, bro. Uh, uh, let's just, no, but um, I I you, I think you said that you are like you want your own like like your own oh, yeah. your own uh like space. Yeah, my own space. I'm used to having my own space. I just need to. I need to have my own thought process. Like when I'm thinking, I don't need nobody to come in, like just bother me and ask me questions or ask me like, "Oh, Mark, what you doing today?" Like, nigga, I'm thinking right now, so just make sure, <laughs> just make I'm sure thinking. you give me my space, my nigga. But that's probably like one of my, yeah, one of my biggest red flags right there. Which is, I'm working on it, by the way. It's it's a condition that I kind of have, but you know, I'm working on it. I think uh, I don't remember. Yours? I don't remember what I said, but I feel like mine will be. I like attention. Like I need attention. I think that's what I said yeah, last time, right? That's what it is, bro. Y'all Scorpios need y'all attention, bro. I need attention. Like even, it doesn't have to be like you have to be all up on me. But if you're watching TV, mm-hmm. that your phone has to be on the on the ground, like like on the side. Don't yeah. be on it. Only on commercials. Pop it up. Look at it real fast. Boom, and come back. You know what I'm saying? Because mm-hmm. I hate that you're not giving me your attention when I want it. Yeah. And I don't know why, but. I yeah, just, y'all Scorpios, y'all like that, bro. I think Trust so. Because my so, girl, even though I even though we I come do this podcast and I'm doing it for a reason because I like it, my girl's just like, oh, I just need you here with me. I'm like, for what? Like, you're just going to fucking fall asleep <laughs> and I'm going to be up fucking playing PS4 or some shit or watching a movie. But she needs me right there fucking so she can fall asleep and she needs, she needs to know that, like, I'm present. And I'm like, why the yeah. fuck? Why? Like, I don't get it. And I'm like, okay. I... 
Now well, I think what it is, like, what did they? Uh, so my sister in law, and uh, so hopefully she hops on here. One, I don't know if I follow her on here, but <laughs> um, my sister in law, oh, now, Nani, shout out to her and shout out to James. Mm-hmm. She had gave us, she had a uh, this, she had this app. It's called I think like uh, Love. I forgot the name of it. She made up her own app. No, no, no. She, she, she like she's oh like check what kind of I forgot the name of the shit, mm-hmm. but she was like um. I think it was called like uh, type of love or some shit like that, but it explains to you what like what each like like a Scorpio or whatever the fuck, right. what kind of love they need, right? Mm-hmm. So us is is like literally attention, like and it and it, and it says like, uh, it doesn't have to be like <laughs> it doesn't have to be like, like physical, physical. It mm-hmm. just has to be like you sitting there with them, like talking to them, and that's it. Like mm-hmm. and yeah, like and I hate when like we're watching TV, bro. <laughs> And literally, he gets house on the phone. I'm like, you fucking bitch. I don't want to cuss her ass out, man. Uh, Sorry if you guys see my fucking moose knuckle, but I just can't put my fucking, I just can't put my, like my, you know, I just. He free, he free balling right now. That nigga ain't got no draws on. <laughs> come on, wait, hop on. Come on, come on, baby. Come on, Jerry Berry. Uh. Yeah, shout out to all five people on my life. <laughs> um, sorry, guys. Good thing your people are not watching mine because you can see my moose knuckle. Uh. But. Yeah, so I think that's a red flag. What's a red flag on a girl for you, though? Red flag on a girl? It's definitely got to be your uh, your personality and your and your mentality as well. Like if 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 you living with me and you tell me like you tell me like oh I don't feel like cooking, can we go out and eat? That's cool. Every once in a while we can do that shit. But if you don't know how to cook. And you just like you just being lazy, like that's that's a big red flag. Like I just feel like so you, women women should know like so your the red flag is if you don't know how to cook. Basically, <laughs> yeah, basically. But it's not even that. It's like you don't even have to know how to cook. You just give the effort. Like, babe, I'm about to make this real okay. quick. It could be like some fucking wings that you just throw in the oven real quick, or just some some random shit like that you just make. It, it could be. It, could it be like just like a like a uh, like a what is it called TV dinner? Hell nah, <laughs> hell nah. I could do that shit myself. <laughs> but you better make sure you got some cooking lessons. Grandma better teach you some fucking cooking lessons. Hey, the TV dinner was fire when we were younger though. Yeah, hell yeah, when you was, nigga. When I was single, bro, nigga, my freezer was stacked with them motherfuckers. Yeah, bro. the only thing it does give me like super bad gas. Yeah, dude. bro, I'm fucking. <laughs> At work, they used to hate. It's just bro. like Jesus Christ. Because mm-hmm. when I used to do overnights, right? So when I used to do overnights at Home Depot, I I was like, all right, well, I don't want to go out and go get something to eat, and yeah. then come back and steal. Like hell no, so I just go heat it up, boom, boom. But man, I'm like, fuck, oh my god, damn, <laughs> be in the toilet for like two hours, like fuck, and then I get home and I'm still, yeah. but yeah, no just- TV didn't be fucking you up though. <laughs> no, what's the red flag in the uh, in a girl? For me, it's somebody that doesn't really uh. Appreciate their family, because yeah. family uh, to to me, family is everything. To me, I understand when you get married, you and Siham, that's your family now. Right. But you still have your other family, right? Mm-hmm. So with me, like when I, I like I said, like I think I said this in the other podcast. Um, I don't like exposing Lydia in her family. Um, you know, like issues. But Lydia then wasn't really close to her mom's. Right. So when I got when I got with her, I said, "Hey, look, you have to kind of forgive t- your mom for like whatever she did to you. You have to forgive her, like because you only have one mom in, in life. You know, you don't have another one. True. She passes away. Like it's easier to be like, oh, it's easier to say, sorry, mom, I forgive you, than wishing that you forgot your mom and always that's gonna be behind your like always thinking about it when she passes away. Mm-hmm. So then we literally got really, you know, we start going to church more." And she started learning the word and, you know, how, like, everything, you know, following the, you know, God's yeah. way. And she told her mom, you know, and that made me even love her more. And I was like, ooh. But at first I was like, man, I don't know, man. <laughs> I don't know. She kind of iffy. Uh, yeah, I was like, I don't know. And then she seen that I was always, like, calling my mom. I was like, you good? And then a lot of people asked me, like, every time you call your mom, you should love you. Yeah. Every single time. I was like, yeah, because you don't know what's going to happen to me or what happened to her. Mm-hmm. So, like, for me to hang up the phone and I say, love you, and then I get a phone call two hours later and say, hey, mom passed away or something happened to mom. That'd be some shit. Yeah, I'd be like, fuck, I didn't even tell her I love you. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, one of the homies, um, 
was always rude to his mom. So I was like, hey, man, like, yeah, that's, that's, not not, that's not it, bro. Like, he's like, oh, yeah, like, but, you know, she pissed me off. Like, yeah, but that's mom's. That's what, that's what mom was doing. Like, that's mm-hmm. your parent. They're supposed to do that. Exactly. They're supposed to piss you off. They're supposed mm-hmm. to tell you, like, you, you, that's not right. That's not right. That's not right. They're supposed to tell you, like, you know, like, you're supposed to get in trouble. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. they... He said, but it's not fair. It doesn't matter. That's it's your not. parents. Like, you're not, that's your parents, and that's all. Like, it's crazy how you, you know, like when we growing up, you we used to get the same type of punishment. Probably our punishment was just a little bit more. I think it was worse. Like, it was worse back was then because back now, like, I if you touch to your kid, it's blow. like, you know, you're going to jail. <laughs> yeah. So back then, my mom was whipping my ass. My mom was whipping my ass, Man. bro. Like, I was telling my younger brother the other day, like, I was like, bro, you grew up because basically he was the only kid. So, he grew up in a kind of a, uh, 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 only the only kid mentality. Mm-hmm. So he he really didn't get like whoopings and shit like that. He got told what to do, but he didn't get ass whoopings like yeah. me and my brother and my sister did. Yeah, we got ass whoopings to where like you act up in a store, <laughs> motherfucker. You getting your yeah. ass whooped when we get back to the car? Did you want so. ever give you that look? Hell yeah, bro. All the time, wow. bro. Like. It made me straighten did, up to did, the point where I wasn't afraid, but it it, it took it to a, a certain level of respect that I have for my mom. Like, all right, I respect my mom and she want me to act this way. I'm going to calm my ass down. Did, did, uh, did, uh, was there like a, like a, a like, cause it, it was, it was four of you guys or just three? It was three of us at the time. Yeah. Oh, so who was it like, who, cause my brother never got whoopings. Uh-huh. My brother always used to like, he would start shit with me in the store <laughs> and I'll get in trouble for it. Yeah. So I get home and get my ass whooped and I'm like, mom, but he starts, oh, wait, 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 wait. And I'm like, yo, that's fucked up. Like, like, and I'm looking at my brother and he's laughing at me. Like, yeah. oh, that's what you, that's what you get, dumbass. You about to get your ass whooped. And I'm like, fuck, and I would take the ass whooping, right? <laughs> I never seen my brother get an ass whooping. Oh, man, shit. I probably, Martel. Martel was like the one that got the ass whooping. So the both. more? Yeah. Damn. Because my mom always caught that nigga with the. With the section, with the second reaction, I would oh. be the first one to fucking start the shit, make fun of this nigga, hit him, run, yeah, and then he'd be the one like beat my ass at the end, and then my mom be like, "All right, your ass getting in trouble." For, so and, and your whoop. sister was my sister, man. She was the only girl at the time, so, so she, she was yeah. So she's like my brother. Yeah, she my was brother the was first. Like, my brother was the only sorry guys in the. In I, think the I think it's the firstborn too. Yeah, sorry guys, if you guys see my moose knuckle, my bad. <laughs> I, just, I know I'm yeah. out here showing my shit, man. Yeah, I'm just trying to like you know. <laughs> don't look at it. Don't look at it. I know, man. My shit. bad. It's just not a good angle. We haven't got the like the 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 phone holder so that we can go live. But you got the bottle opener. Yeah. yeah let me get that. Real. All right, we're gonna pause the camera and so we're right back. All right, all right. Hey, yo! Shout out to Power Karaoke, by the way. Oh man. yeah, tap we'll in with them. Y'all thing, man. Hell, Shout yeah. out to King Gerald Jones, man. Hell yeah. Appreciate you, bruh. So, but I feel like how you were saying, I feel like, oh shit, I feel like, um, generation nowadays, they don't get whooping like, like how we used to. Oh, hell no, man. I like, man. It's a totally, it's a totally different age, bro. Where like, even if you whoop your kids, you're going to be judged. Even if you tell like somebody like uh, this generation, like, oh, I whoop my kids. You can be like, you beat your kids. Like, no, nigga, it's not beat your kids. Nah, it's I discipline. Yeah, yeah, it's discipline. It's discipline. Yeah. I look at it. I looked at it like, like the boy that I was telling you, mm-hmm. that was like always rude to his mom, always talk back to his mom. Bro, I talked to my mom once, mm-hmm. and it wasn't. I feel like it wasn't even talking back. She asked me, "Do you want?" I said, "Do you know how on Wednesdays we used to get out early from Sunday Yeah. So I always used to, you know, we always used to go like to the, um like McDonald's or Jack in the Box yeah. or whatever to get food after. So what so I my mom knew that shit. My mom knew shot. Every Wednesday you get out early, she'll give me twenty bucks so I could go get food. Mm. So that dad came home. We didn't go we ended up going nowhere. We just came straight home. I don't know what happened. But we ended up get, get coming home. She made food. No, no, no. We actually never mind. We actually did. We went to Taco Bell. Don't remember Taco Bell right here? Oh yeah, that old one. Yeah, so mm-hmm. we we went to Taco Bell. Then I came back home and she already knew. Like I'm like, you already knew you already know that um that I went to eat. So she's like, oh, I made food. I said, oh, I'm not hungry. She's like, I didn't ask you that. I said, I made food. Damn. So I'm like, ah, oh, shit. So I put my bag down. <laughs> and she's like, your plate is on the table. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, looking at my brother. And he, he's just already eating. So I'm like, fuck. All right. I want Taco Bell, though. So I sit down. No, I already had eight <laughs> oh, Taco Bell. Ate, yeah. so I wasn't even hungry. So I sit down. And I go like this. I go like, I put the plate down. I said, I'm not hungry. And I get up. By the time I hit the corner, she was already there. 
<laughs> and she's like, what did you say? I said, I'm not hungry. She was like, don't talk back to me. Boom. Boom. Bro, like, oh. punch me. Pick me up. Hit me again. Boom. She dropped me. Stop stopping me. And I said, what? The? And I was like, <laughs> and I said, you broke my ribs. She's like, I didn't break your ribs. And she was like, so I, I, went, in, I went in the room crying and shit. Uh, she nigga, that's, that's beating your bro, kids right there. I said, I didn't even talk back to you. Uh, like, I, I, I just said I wasn't hungry. Uh, so she comes back in the room, cover like probably a couple hours later. And she was like, I'm sorry. And I was like, you like my ribs really hurt so you think I broke them I was like no <laughs> said, I'm sorry it's just like I'm, I'm frustrated and I'm like you wasn't frustrated you uh-huh. <laughs> oh I mean I, pro- I probably was you probably was frustrated but you know you didn't take Shit, it nigga, she had to take it out on somebody bro but I was like I didn't and since that day like never talk back to my moms yeah I, I man, never I think I learned the hard way talking back to my mom I think because like probably get my mom in trouble right now and shit. Will you reach like <laughs> this thing fucking police go to her house? Uh, CPS her it's like shit. it used to be your kid. No, nah, I think it was that I was I was older when I t- when I talked back to my mom. I was like probably like 18, 19. But I'm still living under her roof, so it's you know <laughs> This is what happens when you have kids. Yeah. <laughs> shit everywhere. Yeah, Candles so and shit. When I talk back to my mom, it was like it was like a quick reaction. Like she was like, oh, Mark, did you uh, straighten up your closet? Like, you got a mess in your closet. I'm like, why Why are you going in my room? Oh. She was like, did she ever hit you with the, like, you pay bills? Hell yeah. Oh, nigga, that's what bro. I was about to say. She hit me with, like, that's your room? Nigga, because last time I checked, <laughs> that's my house. I'm like, well, oh, oh yeah. shit. And I was like, oh, damn. She was like, you paying bills for that? You paying bills in here now? I'm like. Nah, you, you catch yourself like, oh like, shit. She was like, well, make sure you make sure you clean that fucking room. I'm like, oh yeah, all right. I'm yeah, like, you straighten yourself yeah, right now. Straighten See, my mom would have came off and smacked me with the fucking chancla or the fucking or <laughs> hand, bro. It's just like boom, like what the fuck. Yeah, so, man. Yeah, it was it was bad. So was, I think that was like a reality check for my ass. Like, damn, I need to get a job. I'm out fresh out of high school. Oh, you? Need, oh, yeah. bro, talking about that. Uh-huh. This is what happened to me, bro. This is what the fuck happened to me. So. Uh, I used to go to Lita's house all the time. I right. get home I'll, and I will walk home. So one day she calls me. She goes, "Hey, out of high school." She calls me. Said, "Hey, uh, she said, what time are you coming home?" And I said, like, "Does it matter?" I said, "All right, that like, doesn't matter." And she was like, "Yeah, like, like I need you home by 10. I said, and I told her, <laughs> "I was like, I'm 18 now." Oh, nigga, nah, <laughs> bro. I got home. She was in my room. She was sitting in my bed, and she said, "You're 18." And I said, like, "Yeah." And she's like, well, then get out. Ooh. And so you pay bills? I said, no. He's like, well, then get out. Pack your shit and leave. And That's I'm like, it. what? He's like, or you stay here. You listen to what I tell you. You're not going to your girlfriend's house no more. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, fucking, I'm on my head. I'm, like, I'm 18. I'm still like, I'm 18. Like, thinking <laughs> I'm fucking crowning and shit. Yeah. She's like, I'm 18. And like, so then she's like, until you pay a fucking bill in this house, mm-hmm. you can do whatever you want. Two days later, I got a job. <laughs> yeah. That's, 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 I said, all right. You can't tell me what to do no more. Change, that shit changes your mentality. Like, when you hear shit like that, like, yeah. damn, I am grown. I do need to start paying some bills. Like, that shit hit. But that shit we, hit different. Me and my mom didn't talk for, like, maybe a week or two mm-hmm. after that. Because I, I actually ended up punching the wall to the, the closet door. Mm-hmm. I punched, bah, I was mad. I walked around the, the, in, uh, here in the, in the hood. Yeah. And, oh, fuck it, man. She called my mom calls Liddy and like, hey, Abraham, go to your house. Like, no, some lady calls me. What's going on? I was like, oh, she kicked me out. She never kicked me out. She was just telling me, like, but I was pissed. Yeah. So I came back home. The next day she talked to me and I was like, oh, fuck, I'll get a job. Woo, woo, woo. And I'm like, all right, cool. So then two days later, my brother goes like, hey, uh, they're hiring at home at Lowe's. I mean, at uh, Church's Chicken. And I was like, oh, I'm there. And motherfucker. And after that, I was out and about. Uh, at and until I got high, until I. Until well, I, I couldn't really be up in the back because I didn't have a car by then, uh. and I would just go back and forth from Lydia. Like, I did that on purpose. Like, I'm gonna stay here until twelve. Uh. <laughs> just let her know I'm out all night. Like, you know what I'm saying? Uh. Um, nah, break, like a sip break. Now nah, my first, my first job. What was man. your? Did you ever work retail? Yeah, I worked at uh, Active Man. Shout out oh, Active you Man. Did. I forgot about I had that. All the Active gear. I got all my SBs from Active Man. You got that a discount was, there? Yeah. What was it? It was like twenty percent off. Oh, that's not bad. Yeah. So any SBs, I was like a hundred bucks. I got them for like close to sixty. Shh, bro, I just seen talking about shoes. I just seen, and I don't know if they're new or not, but the 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 Air Maxes, the Travis Scotts. Oh, those bitches is hard, bro. The oh the the brown and yeah the khakis oh, like they're like bro. Bro, I, I, I think like I'm gonna cop those this week for real. Yeah. 
I think those is like what they range it from like three, three hundred, three something. Yeah, yeah. I, I think was, I'm gonna cop them. Yeah, cop I wasn't gonna them. buy shoes until like at the end of the year, mm-hmm. but I seen those and I'm like, and I like Air Force. I mean, uh, Air Maxes. Right. So I'm like, I'm gonna cop it. I'm, I'm gonna have to cop cop them. Ooh. I just got some shoes for my for my 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 uh my niece. Uh-huh. I'm sending. She got the four the 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 midnight blacks. Or the midnight, oh no, the the army, no the, they the force, they the force, yeah. The midnight navy, navy, yeah. no, no. Or the military black, military black, military. Ooh, black. those is hard. It's the white, the white and black, black, yeah. yeah, yeah. I just got those for my niece. Shout out to my my niece Jordan. I about to say I got um. Any yeah, new this. shoes you got? <sighs> yeah, because the last shoe once you showed me was the threes. Yeah, I got the. I recently got the threes, and then I got the union twos. Man, I've been. Mm. Them Union Twos, man, Union Twos are hard. Uh, Even though the Twos are not my favorite, my favorite silhouette, uh-huh. but the Union Twos are crazy. Yeah, I got the fall gray ones, man. Those you is- know what's those I'm fucking like loving the SB fours, the SB Jordans. Oh, them pine green ones, <laughs> bro. Those are they have the, and I'm not really a big like blue wear kind of guy. Uh-huh. They have another one. I don't know if these are fake or they just like I don't know, but they're like uh they're like um the 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 uh. U.S. No, uh, the U.S. U. Uh, what is it? The, uh, the UCLA. U.S. Yeah, like kind of colors. Uh huh. Bro, those are crazy. But I don't know if they're like you know. I don't yeah, know if they're, they're fucking. They're real. They're real. Yeah, but those motherfuckers is crazy, bro. Those, they they call the the reverse lanies. Okay. Yeah. So those, uh, the SBs though, those just should be fucking crazy. Yeah, man. Fuck, man. I'll. I want to cop. I want to cop the uh, the Jordan Four SBs, but fuck, man, they they going up They're crazy. They going up crazy. Like right I now. seen them two months ago. No, a month ago because I was watching Rami, uh-huh. and um, and they brought the the green ones. And I'm like, oh, I looked them up. They're around like three something. Yeah. I looked them up yesterday. They're my size. They're up to like almost six. Yeah. And I'm like, oh, I should have mm-hmm. copped them when. But yeah. I told myself I'm not gonna buy no more shoes until the end of the year. But Ooh, I, I, bro, you about to miss out on some crazy ass releases because they about to release the. Uh, I, I don't think I'm gonna be able to do that because I'm a, I'm copying those yeah. fucking those those the Air Maxes. Right, those yeah. bitches is clean. Yeah, I don't blame you for that one. Man. Those bitches is clean, one. man. But yeah, so I was watching this uh this um the survival like it's called Alone. And it's a survival. Oh, that's on Hulu. Yeah, have you, no, yeah. Well, I watched it on. It was on Netflix too, uh-huh. but I watched it on Netflix. The new season. I don't know if you watched that. Nah. So I, it's a, it's a, it's a it's a like a reality show, but it's they put you on like in 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 fucking Canada where like the coldest place or whatever the fuck the case is, uh-huh. and the, you try. There's I think it's like ten people that are trying to survive the longest, right. and they win. I think like half a million dollars or a million dollars. Mm-hmm. So I was watching that. So my question to you is, how long do you think you could last in? In a forest or in the in in the woods or whatever. Shit, bro, that's a shit. I might die the first day, my nigga. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> I might die the first day, nigga. I ain't gonna lie because nigga, I'm from the city, bro, and I need I need my electronics, and I'm not like a I'm not like a forest guy. I can I can build some shit, like of course, like with my job, I, yeah. I work with tools, so you know I can build some shit. But as far as like fucking knowing what type of animals I can eat and shit like that, like well, I think you can eat any type of animal. Nah, nigga, some animals that got poison in them and shit, and you can die. Or if you don't, if you don't well, I mean, like, like, like frogs, yes. But like, I think like if you like say like if you they send you to, they send your ass to like fucking let's say let's say fucking Canada, like uh-huh. I think it's called like uh. Uh, British Columbia, British something Canada, whatever it's called, is like one of the Ooh. closest places yeah, in the world. Okay. Yeah, nigga. Uh, but they have rabbits, they got birds and shit. Like you can eat that. <laughs> I'm saying, yeah. I'm pretty sure on some survival type shit. Yeah, I could, I could probably think so, of some shit no, to g- kill. Give yourself. I don't think like I'm, I don't think a day, bro. I think you can last. I feel like couple, like maybe maybe I four can, or five days. You good? I can last probably like a couple of weeks, but shit. If I was just like stranded, nobody else on the island by myself, like type shit, I could say I could last at least a couple months. I would say at least a couple months, just off of the of some shit that I seen on like on like Fear Factor or some shit like that. You know, all, shout out to all the '90s baby who remember the yeah. Fear Factor type shit. Like 
like just eating certain type of shit that I can that I know I can eat or just building like a little shelter or some yeah. shit I can I can make out of. So this. you say like what? What, what would like you your 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 real get like your real estimate like uh-huh. what would be like if you if you get stuck in not stuck but they tell you all right Mark we gonna put you in 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 Canada uh-huh. and we'll see how many days you'll last. I give myself like like a month. A month? A month. Okay. Yeah, I give myself like a month. Uh, how about you, bro? Because I know you I work. Think, I you think, working like fucking. You building shit, so I know you I can think last I, a like, little bit. I could last maybe maybe a month and a half. Yeah. Because what would you eat though? Like if you, I know it's what like rabbits and shit, but like I would eat fish most of the oh, yeah. most most of the like fish, and then if I could like kill like a bear or. Or a, a deer Like that would give me A lot of meat for like mm-hmm. But I never like I mean I went hunting But everybody set Like they, they set the fucking They set the gun for me And I just shot Yeah You know what I'm saying I didn't like I didn't like actually Like oh Like <laughs> fucking look down And start searching for fucking Like footprints and shit I, Yeah You know I, My best bet is to go fishing uh-huh. That's like how I'll survive. But if I have like a, a like a bird or or a duck, right? Like a, like a duck or a dove, and if I have a gun, boom, I'm I'm getting. Yeah, what if you just all right? They just gave you like a rope and a knife and like fucking. Well, then I'm fucked. Like a cup, like a case of water. Like that's it. Like that's all you had. Like. Well, I'm fucked then. Yeah. Because in this in this in this show, they you can bring ten things. Oh, all right, so yeah, okay, bring, okay, okay, okay. Right, let's put it like this. What will you bring? You didn't say that. The, what, ten, the beginning. I think it's ten things or five things, but let's do ten. Ten. What will you bring? If like today, I'm like, all right, Mark, uh, we we got booked for this fucking show. Right. You had you got ten things to pack in twenty four hours. Go. A snow jacket. Okay. A fucking shit. A blanket. A big ass warm blanket. A knife. A flare gun. Um. Excuse me, guys. Uh, I would say a raft. Okay. Um, a backpack. Uh, what else? Um, a, a, well, I already said a knife, but a hammer. Uh huh. Um, what else? You can't bring your phone. Well, you, shit, th- there's, there's, you can't charge that bitch. So. I wouldn't say you can actually bring a phone, so you can't charge it unless you bring like a portable charger. But you need something to charge that shit. Uh-huh. But so I probably wouldn't bring a phone, but I bring like I would say a case of water. Uh huh. Um, this nigga said a case of water. Yeah. <laughs> where you at? What where you at? How many? I'm at eight. At eight. Okay. Eight. Okay. Um, a life jacket. Okay. Like a, a life jacket so where if I'm on a raft I can float. Okay. If I if I get dumped out that bitch. Um and shit, my girl really. <laughs> so I <laughs> <laughs> So I won't be bored on that motherfucker. Oh, Which girl? I'll bring oh. my wife. <laughs> all right, all right. So what was that? Ten? The yeah, last one was ten. Right? Okay. So yeah, what's your ten, bro? So my first will be uh Will be a maybe a fishing pole. Uh huh. Ooh, a, damn! I didn't say that, bro. No, you I fucked up. You fucked up. You can't damn. take it back. A fishing pole. Mm-hmm. I will go. Uh, maybe a, a barn arrow. I don't know how to use a barn arrow, but I'll use. Nigga, I was say, do you know how to use that shit? <laughs> I don't know how to use a barn arrow, but uh-huh. you know, barn arrow. Then I'll bring like a like a what is it called? Like a a, a to like to spark like. What is it called? Oh uh, fuck you, Brenda, because you know uh, Colombian food is bomb as fuck. <laughs> uh, yeah. Um, what is that called when you like like a to like spark shit like um, a sparker? I don't know what it's called. Like to like make fire. I never heard it. Well, I I don't know. I know what you mean because it's just like a little thing that you just yeah. And it, like you met, you ever have welding class? Yeah. So you know that stuff that you like hit and then like and then it sparks. Yeah. yeah. So I I'll bring one of those. Okay, yeah. I'll bring like, like um, a blanket mm-hmm. for sure. Uh, I bring one of those things like you could like, uh, like like a, the straw that you could like uh, filter the water. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> you mean like a snorkeling? No, no, like it's the straw that you could like, like you could drink water from like from a river and uh-huh. you would be solid. 
Like it doesn't have Like it, it filters, filters the water the Yeah it filters all the bad shit Even though like, you can just Like boil the water uh-huh. But you can just do that yeah. Then I'll bring like a Like a like a pan or, or Oh bro, yeah Bro you, you fuck You messed up I can't cuss Cause, I'm, uh, cause like, I'm in uh, Cause I'm in fuck, I'm on TikTok live And they, they're really They're really like Crazy with it So um That was seven I mean that was six Uh My backpack for sure uh-huh. A knife Uh no, I already said axe, huh? Did axe. I say axe? Well, I'll bring an axe, axe instead of yeah. an axe, you know? If uh-huh. I didn't say that. Uh, got two more. <laughs> a, a book? <laughs> a book? <laughs> Just so I can read something, bro. Oh, fuck, nigga. Yeah, that's a good, that's um, a good ass idea. I'll and, bring a survival book. And then a rope. <laughs> oh, rope, yeah. And that's that's my 10 things that I would bring. Yeah, those are... Th- I think I, if I bring all that stuff... I think I'll be solid for maybe a month, yeah. or maybe a month or two. Mm-hmm. I think you will with the stuff you brought. I don't think you would be nigga. You don't think I'll be solid, bro? You didn't even bring it. Like you didn't even bring like a. a how are you gonna fish, nigga? With a raft. Yeah, but how? How are you gonna catch oh, a fish? Shit, yeah. You didn't. Even, did you bring a knife? Yeah. You did. Okay, maybe with the knife you could like like <laughs> like stab, the stab him or something. <laughs> but I don't know. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I didn't. Think you didn't even bring it. nothing to make fire with. Oh, nigga, you can make fire <laughs> with rocks, bro. You can rub rocks together. And but have you ever tried to make fire with rocks? No. I tried, and no. this is like the that hardest thing. <laughs> this is the I hardest should, thing in the world. You know what? I should have said a magnifying glass too. Fuck yeah, you, you messed can, up. You can do that shit too. You messed up. What's up, guys? Everybody on TikTok, how you guys doing? This is my podcast. We're doing it right now. So the question was, how many days can you survive in the wilderness, mm-hmm. and what ten things can you bring in? Yeah, shout out to my Instagram live, man. Comment down below if you Sorry if you guys see my my moves <laughs> knuckle. I'm just yeah, just the angle is just bad. Yeah, comment on down below if uh ten things that you would bring. Yeah, ten things you would bring. You would bring to a deserted island oh, well, to I'm gonna help tell you, guys you keep yourself alive, man. Five. Cause I know there's a lot of stuff to you guys write. But what's good, what's good, everybody? What's good, what's good? Yeah. Uh make sure you guys are tapping the screen so more people could come in. Tap, tap, tap away. Tap, 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 tap. But, um, yeah, bro. I think for me, uh, I say if I bring all this stuff, a month and a half, if I didn't have, oh, month or a month or two, I'm going to say month or two, if I didn't have none of that, I, I'll probably just last a week. Yeah, me too. Like a week and I'm like, all right, well, how do I? I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a real city nigga, so, you know, I need my, I need my electronics. I need fucking, you know, my... What's my, good? What's good? My meat. I need like fucking certain type of meat so I can survive. I can't just eat fish all fucking day. I don't know how to kill something and, and cut that shit open and fucking take out the insides and shit like that. Cause you gonna you never need, did that. Nah, man. I have to that. take you to Florida. Ooh, you did that shit before. Yeah, you cut something open and you. Yeah. Oh, I can't do it, bro. Well, I did. I didn't do it in Florida. I went to Montana. What'd you cut open? Uh, it was a scroll. Ooh, in a in a in a in a rabbit in a snake. How'd you do it? Like, um, you cut it from like. The- so uh, my uncle taught me to go like straight down, mm-hmm. and then go to the legs, and then from the legs work yourself back to the head. Damn. Yeah, and then you take off from you know. I don't want to be super like graphic here because takes like <laughs> a little, you yeah. know. So you can't. You like you didn't get like a little like kind of sick. Like, fuck. Like, oh. oh no. I I think I would, bro. Um. I feel bad. <laughs> I feel bad. I just man. I just you just killed. The I just killed thing. something. Like I killed a you know. But my uncle, how my uncle put it is like, we have to eat. Yeah. Because we went camping, mm-hmm. even though like we went camping like up the hill where he lives at. Yeah. Still like, <laughs> <laughs> like we still we camping. Like nigga, we live. <laughs> you can we literally walk back to his house. <laughs> But we just, but, but because he lives in Montana, he has his big, big ass land, mm-hmm. and we went and make sure you guys are tabbing the screen because we are saying a lot of stuff and we don't want to get a uh, banana. Yeah. Make sure you guys keep tabbing that screen, please, for me. Keep tabbing if you coming, if you guys enjoying the the conversation. Make sure you guys are tabbing in. But if you guys want to check out the podcast, by the way, I'm gonna take a little break. Make sure you guys tap in in the Woods podcast. Yeah, yes. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, so the way that my own, because I was kind of like. Like I don't I don't I don't want I was like I think I want to say I was money like maybe eleven or twelve. I was like, oh I don't want to do it I don't want to do it, mom. Cause I stopped being a little, <laughs> and I was like, all right, son, and I, <laughs> and, you know, so 
and I went and grabbed it. I'm like, oh, I felt so bad. Like I was like, but oh, uh, but it's weird because I went fishing. I didn't feel bad. I think because fish are just like it's more like of. Uh, I feel like fish don't have feelings. Yeah, really. <laughs> <laughs> I mean it's a living thing But it's just like Fish is just so common I feel like it doesn't have catch. I feel like I don't know what I feel like fish doesn't have Like they don't have brains They're just swimming Yeah they're just But swimming. they're like Some of the some of these fish Are the smartest things in the world Yeah Right so I'm like man But I don't know why I don't feel bad When I go fishing uh-huh. You know but When I went in, inside This fucking squirrel I was like I'm gonna start crying and shit like, <laughs> I don't know if I would do it again Like I mean yeah. I wanna go back I wanna go sh- hunting again mm-hmm. And um, I had the chance in Alaska But I don't know what happened We went fishing down in Alaska Yeah I think What's like I think we probably We probably said this before But like What's what's one of the most exotic things You've eaten um, You've eaten uh, I would say gator Gator yeah, I said gator. I heard it's chewy as hell. It it t- to me it tastes like well it depends how you so it depends a lot how they like they they um uh, they skin it and and butcher it basically. Right. If they don't know what they're doing, then it's gonna be gamey and gonna be. But my uncle has this friend that has been doing it for the, since he was a baby kid, mm-hmm. and he went and he cut up. We had a uh, the back the it's called back a uh, back long black back long back. It's a the back name. muscle basically, uh-huh. uh, and this shit was so good. Yeah, he fried it. He put it fried it. Boom boom, and then he had we had ribs. We had the ribs. We had gator ribs. That gator shit. ribs. Man, <laughs> everybody if if you from the south like Mississippi, yeah. no uh, Louisiana in the Bayou, you already know what we talking about. Yeah, because man, cause. that shit. Florida, if anybody's seen from Florida, you already know what we talk about. Uh, <laughs> that shit was good. I'm about to say that the most exotic thing I ever ate was probably rabbit soup. Oh, I actually ate a bear bear burger. Oh. I think that would be like the like. I don't know which one will count more, like you know, erratic. Yeah. Oh. I mean, yeah, because shit, it's not common, motherfuckers eat bear, really. Have you had, have you had deer? Yeah, I have deer. Deer is good. My my grandma, she surprised me with that shit. Like, oh, it's how about rabbit? Because rabbit's real. Rabbit's good. Rabbit's good, man. I thought it was just little pieces of chicken that she put in there, but well, I feel like gator tastes like chicken. Yeah. If I wouldn't like seeing them cooking it, I would have been like, oh, this is chicken. (laughs) But I, I already I knew that it was gator, so I was like, oh. Make sure you guys are tapping the screen, guys. Make sure you guys are tapping, 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 tapping. Now the tap. thing is, like, my grandma, she tricked my ass. Like when I was, <clears throat> when I was six, she made me some rabbit soup. I thought it was chicken noodle soup because it just had the same type of ingredients, same type of noodles, all that shit. And she was just like, "Oh, here's some soup. Here, eat it." Mm-hmm. I'm like, "All right, I'm sick, so I'm eating this shit." I'm like, "Oh, it's good." And she's like, "She's like, oh, you like it?" I'm like, "Yeah." You're like, was, oh, this shit is rabbit. I, I just thinking, cut outside. Yeah, basically, I was like, "Oh, it's chicken noodle soup." She's like, "Nah, it's." Rabbit me, shoot. me and your grandpa, we killed a rabbit. What? I was like, y'all killed. What was rabbit? this at? Oh, I was in. I was still living in L.A. at the time. Where the fuck did they get the rabbit from? Man, my man, my grandma. She's from Mississippi, man. Yeah, but what part of what part of L.A.? In South Central, South Central. Where the LA. fuck did they get the rabbit from? Bro, my my gra- my grandpa has he has chickens. And oh, okay. Rabbits. So they were they were like they they yeah. had them. In the okay, okay. Plus, he used to get them imported from where he used to live, from Mississippi. He used oh. to get them imported here, and then he used to, you know, skin them and kill them and shit like that. So it was, it was just common for. <laughs> Bro, me. I just keep looking down. You see my just my knuckle there. <laughs> I'm sorry, I know, guys. I hope they not looking at my. Shit. I'm sorry, you guys see my moose knuckle. Yeah, but like even like when I was in third grade, like my 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 teacher, she had us write down what type of pet we had. Everybody put cat, fucking hamster. Dog. Uh, fucking whatever. Uh, just the the common pet that you have around the house. Yeah, I put a pig, and my teacher was like, "You really have a pig at your house?" I'm like, "South Central, yeah, a pig with the yeah, exactly." She was like, "You really got a pig at your house?" I'm like, He's "Yeah, like, yeah we about to eat it later." And like, she called my grandma, and she was like, "Is is is, is he my lying? Right? Yeah, yeah, is he lying?" She was like, "No, we really got a pig at our house." I'm like, she was like, "Oh, you wasn't lying. I'm sorry." I'm like, "Nah, my grandpa like." He really into like yeah. farming like that, and like when he moved down here, he he kept that same tradition as far as like 
making sure like his yeah. kids grew up with the same. And that's of, your dad's mom or your dad. I mean, your dad's parents or your mom's. My parents? dad's parents. Okay. Okay. Yeah, man. So, Cause you say your mom is like born and right, raised, like their parents are from California. Yeah, California okay. through and through. Yeah, yeah. All right, we're gonna uh, cut the cut the cameras, and we'll be right back. Cause I need some more ice. Mm -hmm. All right, man. Uh, let me get this going. Sorry, my rain force is going up. Rain force is going. Finish that. I might need to buy some more of this. Oh. Yeah, let's set this up. I'll eat that. <laughs> what the? Fuck? Nigga, they got a they got a timer on Instagram Live to like how long you can be on live or what? Uh, they do. I don't know. They like tell you like you got a timer remaining. Shout out to Alma. Oh, I don't know. I didn't know that. Let me close. Let me. <clears throat> All right. All right. Yeah, man. I think I. We're saying, you know, yeah. does your grandpa still have all that shit right now or no? Nah, rest in peace, grandpa, oh, man. Never mind. <laughs> never mind. <laughs> rest in peace, grandpa. Rest in peace. He made sure Your my childhood was uh was really fucking uh different. Yeah. As far as like just having like different type of pets and shit. Are you are you an animal person or no? Yeah, I think my brother, my brother Martel, he made me an animal person, like. Like, cause he was he was into like the whole like having pets in the house and shit like that and like just being a real nature boy type shit. So he really got me into having like pets and shit. But like, nah, not like you, bro. You got lizards and yeah, reptiles kinda, and all types of shit. If I if 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 I win the lotto or this podcast goes somewhere and we start making crazy bread, I'm definitely gonna buy a farm or like a land and have like goats. Cows, pigs, for real? Yeah, bro. That's like my dream, bro. <laughs> that's crazy. That's not my dream. Like I want, I really want a horse. Yeah, I, I like really want a horse. But what the fuck am I gonna put him here? Yeah, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, what the fuck? You walk in, I have a horse in the room and like, shit. Why the fuck is a horse in here, bro? <laughs> um, <laughs> it's but, what I really wanted. <laughs> yeah, that, that's like, 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 what I like if I ever like make crazy money, uh -huh. that's what I really want to do. I just want to buy land, build, and then have like my little ranch in the woods. Ooh. Ranch, yeah, that would be dope to have like a whole, yeah, a whole like in the woods podcast thing yeah. as a ranch part. Yeah, that would be sick. So, but if I ran into like some crazy bread like that, oh, see, look at that shit. They timed you off already, yeah, that's crazy. I didn't know they had timer, I didn't know they had timer either. So how do all these people like this? So the thing is, man, social media is so like biased. Like if you have a crazy following, they're not gonna stop you doing shit. But if you only have like two followers, I'm like, oh, you only got two seconds. <laughs> they really turn me off, bro. You can't go live again? No. Okay. Like, oh, go ahead. Cancel that. And then Damn, they really fucked you up. Oh, damn, they really turned you off. Yeah. Oh, right here. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Unless you got banned. I know. <sighs> but um, you say if you have crazy bread like that, what would happen? If I had crazy bread like that, the first thing I'll do is make sure, you know, my mom and them. Well, have yeah, bread. That, I mean, yeah. that would be like my first thing, but like. Like my goal in life is to get a ranch. Yeah. Yeah, that's my goal in life. I would say I have like I get my mama crib, then of course I buy like um I buy, buy uh the craziest shoes in the world. Yeah, exactly. I buy some Air Max, nigga. Just to just to have them so I could just hang above like my my What they're my going wall for like what like 1500 right now? Shit, more than that, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Like close to like I would say like ten grand. What? Yeah, like it's more. It shoes. It shoes more than that, bro. Yeah, like, but like, like what shoes more than that? Uh, close to Red Octobers. The Red Octobers. Oh. Easy. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Kanye. He probably got one of the most expensive shoes. How much is that? Probably like eight grand. Close to eight grand. <sighs> Crazy. I haven't seen them, but or no, actually the Louis Vuitton. 
The Louis Vuitton Air Forces. Shout out Virgil, man. Those are crazy. Yeah, those are crazy. I get the high. T- I get the mid top joints, man. Those are crazy. I seen them. Uh, they brought some at Cool Kids. Ooh. Yeah. And they they were trying to get them bad, and the guy wasn't but like budging like nah like I can't. Yeah. They're trying to get them for like I think it was like five thousand. Yeah. The guy's like he wanted like seven, and he was. <laughs> Yeah, they're like, want, nah. man, those are, man, those are so hard. I probably, I probably would only wear them to like a big event, like some type shit. Like, I wouldn't even wear them, bro. You wouldn't wear them? I would just have them like framed by boom. Nigga, I'll probably wear them motherfuckers. Like, <laughs> I'll wear them motherfuckers to a family event or some shit and just be like, yeah, them motherfuckers is hard. Oh, shit. Or just wear them like with like a tuxedo or some shit. Yeah. Or like a suit or some shit and just fuck, yeah. fuck dress shoes. Like, I got on like ten thousand. But have shoes. you ever seen like everybody like some people wear like tux and chucks? Yeah, I seen that. Those shit. shit, that shit look clean. I thought about when I when, when you know when I got married, I thought about wearing some. Uh, yeah, me too. <laughs> I I thought about wearing some ones. Like I was like I was like, babe, what you think? Like yeah, I can, I can wear these. She was like, no. Yeah, oh, hell no. Same here. It's like fuck. Same here, bro. That's same it. here. That shit. Was I was so like, hard. oh, I was like thinking like, what am, what do I wear my wedding day? And we kind of went for a, uh, for a uh, beach team, so you were there. Yeah, yeah, that shit was dope, man. So we had a uh, so we have two questions of the week this week. Yeah, let's get into those. And um, so first of all, the first question we had was the red flag, and I wanna I wanna shout out my my brother in law and my sister in law James and Nani because I posted on on Facebook, and um, because. <laughs> I guess I, I guess I can make bread off of Facebook now, so I'm monetized on Facebook. Oh, shit. So there we Congratulations go. Congratulations to AB man. Yeah, and yeah, I don't even have a thousand followers. Do a round of applause for that. Man. So I don't um, I don't have a thousand followers, and I think that's a request. But because our mm-hmm. our reels that I'm be posting on on Facebook are making like like two 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 thousand views. Yeah man. Shout so, out to everybody on Facebook. Man. Yeah, shout out everybody. I'm thinking of making my Facebook the end of what's Facebook. Mm-hmm. So and I could just put a constant like more 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 people so people could come and see more. Yeah. Uh and I posted on Facebook, I said, like, What's a red flag? So my sister in law Nani. Right. Shout out to her because she's a Scorpio too. She has the same <laughs> birthday as me. Right. She said, uh when he asks you uh, if you want something from the gas station and you say no and he still comes back with nothing in it, so let's talk about that real uh, fast. Let's talk about it. So like if my if so my, if you go, you know you get off the car and be like hey you want something and she says no and you come back with nothing they get mad right. What do you think about that? I think it's bullshit <laughs> because if I'm if I'm getting out the car and I, I ask you if you want something, babe, do you oh, do you want some chips? Do you want a soda? Do you want water? What do you want? And she tells me nothing. I'm gonna assume that you want nothing. nothing. So I'm not gonna get you. But shit. I let you know something about Scorpios. That's a test. Yeah, that is a test. That's a fucking test. My girl be like, you didn't bring back no chips. You didn't bring back no beef jerky. You didn't bring that. Mm-hmm. We need something for the road. Like, well, what the fuck? I got me something for the road. Yeah. I asked you if you want something for the road. So don't get me fucking confused. And don't put me to the test because I, I'm not gonna I'm lie. Gonna I, did, I, did, I did that to Lydia once. Yeah. I mean, a couple times. For so real. you want something for Starbucks? No. It's Starbucks, bro. They always want something. No, no, no. Like she asked me. Oh, she asked you. And I said no. And then when she get home, and I was like, "Where's mine?" She was like, "You need one." And I'm like, "Damn, you didn't." I couldn't get mad. I couldn't get mad. Yeah. Okay. And then the other one she said is when they walk by you and you smack their ass, James. That's a must. I'm sorry. I like. I know this is your sister, Uh, but every time I walk by your sister, I am. A full hand and I'm fucking <laughs> just yeah. so James, this is for you. Every time you walk by Nani, you give her a high five, okay? <laughs> nah, I can't lie, I do the same shit. Yeah, you girl. have to. It's a must. Like, yeah. you know, it's a must because she goes, like, just tell me you don't like me. Yeah. <laughs> you know, like it's a must. But for girls, you don't do that to a guy. I know. At all. It's it's kind of weird. It's you don't do that to a guy. At all, like you don't smack that booty at all. Like that's just not, unless we tell you to. Yeah. Then you go ahead and do it. But if you just come and smack us in the ass, it's just. If it's on some funny shit, like if it just not even funny. funny shit, bro. Like you can't don't <laughs> like. She goes, "Why you let your boys do it? Because they're my boys." <laughs> well, well, everybody who who's uh who's on this Instagram live, man. Shout out to uh. Shout out to my boy Double Tap. Oh yeah, shout out my boy uh. 
my boy Double Tap, man. Shout out to you, man. Uh, shout out my boy, uh, <laughs> my boy Juan on here too, man. Oh, shout out, shout but, out. Um, everybody know, everybody know. I got a, I got a nice size ass, man. You and, and James. Yeah, I got a nice size ass. So my girl, she just automatically know. Bam, like if I. How in does the that kitchen, make you feel? It it uh, it push you down. Yeah, it kinda, I don't have ass, bro. And when Liddy come and touch me, I'm like, mm. it kind of it kind of did. You just want to turn. <laughs> yeah, it, just give one of those. I don't know what to do. Sometimes I just be like, I kind of pause and I think about it. Like, babe, did you just really like just slap my ass? I'm up here <laughs> cooking for your ass. Like, it's like, why do you have to just like? Cause you just feel that shit jiggle, and I'm like, yeah. <laughs> I don't like that. It, what do you call it's it's the mass. Yeah, yeah. Like, Masculating. Dis- ma- I forgot how to say that shit. Dismaculating. Dismaculating. <laughs> it's dismaculating. <laughs> I'm a little tipsy right now. I forgot how to say it. It's dismaculating. It's like, you take away my manhood yeah. when you do shit like that. Like, and that's I don't- what, look, and when I explained that to Lydia, she was like, but it's just us. I don't give a. F- I don't give a f- if it's just us, if it was just you, if mm-hmm. it's like, just don't do that. He's like, but you do that to me. I was like, but you got a solid you want, right? Yeah. And you're a girl, and that's. It's what is <laughs> what happens when I just don't do it again, ever again. So I'll be happy. No, you wouldn't. Nah, no, you would. Like, why? Yeah, yeah, you like. Oh, you just didn't. <laughs> like, oh, why you don't love me no more? What you mean I don't love you no more? You didn't spend um, my ass this time. I, I I don't know what James said. I just know that he had he post uh not he post uh when when they don't know the lyrics to Hannah Montana. What the fuck? <laughs> Like the theme song, <laughs> nigga. Do you know it? <laughs> no, you don't know it. <laughs> I know like the only the only one I know is like the that's so Raven. Fuck it. You didn't watch Hamilton? Song. No. I watched. Hell no. Nah, I watched nigga. You watched that shit? <laughs> nah, nigga. I used to watch like that's so Raven and shit like that. Just I because, thought. Like, I thought. Sister. I look. I thought that was uh uh Miley Cyrus was pretty hot. Miley Cyrus at that time she was, was hot. So yeah. I don't had to watch it. It's the best. The best. But at that time, Sorry, I just, I, you know, I had to put it out there, you know. <laughs> no, at that time, man, shit, that's so Raven. That's so Raven and one on one was like my you said shit. You're lying. Somebody said you're lying. He's like, you used to watch that shit. Nigga, I didn't. I used to watch I that shit all God. the time. It was I that's so need- Raven, the Sweet Life of Psycho Cody, and Hannah Montana. I used to watch The Proud Family. The Proud Family, yo. That's so Raven. I think uh, you're racist, bro. I'm sorry. I probably yeah, know. I think you're racist because that all, everything you just you just fucking name is all black. I'm sorry. <laughs> them, them white shows used to be so corny to me. You didn't I'm watch. Hey, you didn't. You didn't watch uh, uh, the Sweet Like a Second Cody. No. What? My little brother did, but no, no. What? I didn't. I'm sorry. I, I'm probably a little bit biased, a little bit racist. Yeah, he but, racist. But them white My shows were so corny, bro. Like, I'm sorry. Smart. Did you watch Smart Guy? Yeah. Racist, <laughs> smart guy, yeah, that was my shit too, man. Shit. The Steve Harvey show, all that shit, man. Damn, did you watch? Uh, did you watch uh, Family Matters? Yeah, remember when you should call him? Yeah, you see, he's calling Carl Winslow. <laughs> I did used to low key look like that nigga, man. Bro, I was, I was chubby. I was chubby back bro, then. Bro, tell me why. Tell me why. Um, I still watch this shit to now, now. Like, I still watch that shit now. Like, bro, yeah. I, I hop on. What's it on? On. On Hulu, no, it's is not it on Hulu? Hulu. No, it's on on HBO Max, oh, and yeah, I sit there and watch it. And every time I see it and come out, I was like, I tell it. I used to call Mark Mr. Winslow, and he's then he was like, "That's messed up." Yeah. He probably hates you for that. And I was like, "If he hated me, he wouldn't be here right now." No, I <laughs> but I always used to call this nigga uh, Mr. Winslow. <laughs> yeah, man, shit. I, I well, I always knew why you called me that shit, man. That shit was just the funniest show, man. That was like one of the. Did you watch the Wayne Brothers? Of course. Did you watch Martin? Of course. You're racist, bro. Yeah, bro. I'm just, You're racist to, to the whites. I'm sorry, I'm sorry man. To the whites. <laughs> y'all all know them black sitcoms was like the yeah, best yeah, the fucking, best, ones. Like, the best shows. You know which one I, I watched, but I really didn't really fuck with like that, was the uh, the Fox show. Jimmy Fox Jimmy show. Fox? Uh, yeah, I didn't tripping. really get in. Like, I really didn't get into it like that. I would watch everything. I was like, uh, what was the other one? Uh, uh, I was going to say Moana, but it's not Moana. It's... Uh, <sighs> Was with a girl, uh, something with M. Um, Moisha, Mo- Moisha. Mo- Mo- I used yeah. to watch that shit. Sister, sister. Yeah, man. Shout out to my sister, man. She used to. She put me on to that shit heavy. Moisha. Yeah, sister, sister. I used to like watch all them bitches. Damn, it was so many. You don't, you don't really get sitcoms like that anymore. Nah. But those those TV shows used to teach me so much about like just growing up. 
being like being a part of the culture growing up and like using certain type of language and shit. Oh yeah, man, that shit used to teach me so much. Like, like I used to love the Wayne Brothers. Like that's like oh, my man, shit, bro. Like I, shit, yeah. I used to stay up because they used to always come on at ten. Mm-hmm. So it would be like two two episodes. Yeah. So it'd be ten to, to eleven because it was thirty minute episodes. Right. And I used to sit there and like, and I always used to like, me and my cousin got that word kid from them. Like, oh, hey, kid. Like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> hey, kid. Like, so I'm like, oh, hell yeah. And then like, uh, um, there was another word that I used to use. Uh, uh, what was it? It was another, like, he's like, hell, he's like, this is the ghetto, the, the ghetto something speaking. You know, it was something like, and every time I would answer the phone, I would say that shit. Uh-huh. And I'm, like, every, like, I'm Cuban Puerto Rican, bro. Like, and I'm saying that in, in English, and everybody will, like, my grandma called me, and he's like, what the fuck are you saying? I'm like, oh. But, uh-huh. like, like you say, you pick up, the, like, the language and shit, like, yeah. uh, with, like, uh, I used to say like, did I do that when I used to get did in trouble? Did I do that? Oh <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's yeah. Shout out Family Matters, yeah. man. I, fam, family Matters and Wayne Bros are like one of my top favorite fucking sitcoms. Yeah. Like I could sit there and watch them twenty four seven, and it, and it's crazy because. Uh, uh, HBO has all them. Yeah. So I'd be just sitting there. Even my daughter would be like this. Just watching it. Yeah. I'm like, okay, okay. She's uh, fucking digging it. That's a good thing. Like. When you when you put your kids onto certain shit like that, they they come fond to that, and then they go back and watch all that shit that you used to watch, and it's it's a it's 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 kind of a joy to see shit like that. Yeah. My little brother would go watch shows that I used to watch. Like now, we go see every Marvel movie together. Okay. Like I told him, like I was a big Marvel fan when it was when I was growing up, and yeah. now to see him on that shit, I was like, damn. Now I can have something to relate to him with, and like you say, you like scary movies, huh? Yeah. Did you go watch the uh that that new um exercise movie? Oh, with the Pope and shit. Yeah. Nah, I heard it's pretty good. I'm not. I bet it is. How about, about Evil 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 Dad? Nah, you're not gonna watch that. Yeah. Oh, okay. But I don't have nobody to watch it with. Your girl. My girl scared. Oh, yep. Well, I guess you're going by yourself. <laughs> yeah, I'm going by myself. Or I gotta wait till that shit yeah. come on TV or some shit because I can't see it with nobody else. So I gotta go by myself probably. So we talked about uh. We talked about um, red flags on the girl and right. our red flags. Mm-hmm. And so you had a question of the week this week. What was it? A question of the week and Instagram live. I want to hear what y'all got to say about live, this. Let's hear it. What's your, what's your biggest pet peeve? And I'm going to give you mine so you can have an example of what a pet peeve is. A pet peeve. My biggest pet peeve is I'm always losing my hats. I'm always losing my hats. I can't find... How? Because I don't have them organized at all. I kind of how many have, hats you have? I probably have about probably twenty five hats. Me too. But yeah. the ones I only wear, I just put them up here. Yeah, and then the rest are in the closet. I probably got about yeah about twenty five to thirty hats. Um, I would say, but I I can never find my fucking hats, and that's that's on me. I don't organize them at all. I I probably just like. But is that a pet me though? Pet Pete though? Well, I think a peppy is like what pisses you off, right? Like that's the yeah, what pisses me. But well, I guess, piss, I guess, that, I guess yeah. that pisses you. Off. Okay, okay. Uh, but okay, a solid pet peeve when when you're driving and the person that has to make a right turn doesn't know he can make a right turn on red light. Oh, and you just sit in there, and he just sit in there, and I'm okay. like, bro, turn, turn, bro, turn, go. I'm just, I know, that, I know that's a lot of a lot of people pet peeves, like. If a person knows that he on a right hand turn, and a and a light's red and he don't know to go, mm. that shit pisses me off. Bro. Um, my biggest pet peeve is I think is slow people. Slow people like like mentally challenged. No, 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 not 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 that. <laughs> like I hate like like Lydia, bro. She takes. <laughs> Two hours to get out the car. Like I'm, saying, nah, I'm just saying like two hours, but it, it take her so long. <laughs> I'm already halfway to the house, and she's still barely like getting off the car. And said, like, "Why are you taking so fucking long?" Oh, a person that takes their time. Yeah, and I'm like, "Yo, like, uh, come on, let's go, come yeah. on, like, I, you know, let's go." And she's like, uh, "Like, yeah. she purse, purse her purse down first, and then her fucking water bottle, and then she looks at the seat like something's wrong with it." And I'm like. Yo, <laughs> just get in the car, son. I'm already in here. I'm burning up. 
especially in the summer. If you know, in, the, in California, summertime, you need to hop in the car and turn the heat on. Already in here. Like, come on. Me and Algie just sitting there, like, yeah. <laughs> but she takes so long. The other thing is, I, don't, I think I guess it's just with her though. Uh huh. Oh no, I, my biggest pet peeve is when people act. <laughs> they act like they know me. Oh, they just be like they see you in public, like no, like like I just met you and you act like you know me. Oh, oh yeah, what's up, bro? I don't know you. Stop, <laughs> stop right there. Ask my name. Ask how what, what, what day I was born. Ask what my nationality is. Ask me what kind of fucking underwear I have on right now before uh, you ask. Act like you know me. That's a good one. That's so, that is a good one. Cause I have so, uh, I have people like that that think they know me like so. That uh, Leslie in here on on Instagram, I mean on TikTok Live said, "My biggest pet peeve is when somebody leaves my room and doesn't close the door." Ooh, that's that's a good one. That's a good one. That's a hell of a good one. Man. That's a good one. I would say that too. If you don't fucking close my door, bro, I'll be fucking pissed. Oh yeah. Uh, but I guess what Lydia is, I hate how my biggest pet peeve with Lydia is. But what about with your girl? My biggest pet peeve with Lydia is how she puts the on. Uh, she goes like this, bro. She goes like this, right? Uh-huh. And then she goes like this. She does it with one hand? Yes, bro. Why? That fucking pisses me, though. I switch hands. Fuck off, bro. <laughs> I'm literally like, I look at her, I'm like, why? And she's like, why? why do, I said, why don't you do this? And, right? and makes, do this. Yeah. Instead of like. Cramping up That's dude. weird bro I ain't never seen Nobody That's do that serious. shit That's somebody That could kill you bro Oh uh, what the fuck And then when she puts Lotion on She goes like there, Squeezes it God damn Why <laughs> Why, Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> The lotion's gone At that time bro <laughs> There's no more lotion Just putting sweat On your fucking You just putting sweat In your arms And then she do it And then after she's done She's like this what what else you got left? <laughs> and I was like, well, stop, please. Like, there's no more lotion. Bro, it pisses me off. <laughs> All right, I would say. <laughs> <laughs> bro, that shit pisses me off. All right, I would say. Um, well, my girl fucking. Oh, my God. All right. When, when she's cooking, when she's cooking, she don't put shit back correctly. What do you mean? Like, and that's like Are you a really organized guy? Like you will like key. You want the the Like the pepper And the same pepper Like all Nah the, nah Not oh, like that okay, Nah okay. yeah I'm not like that bro But <laughs> like If she cooking If she cooking like chicken Right mm-hmm. And she only use Half of the chicken And she want to put it Back in the freezer She just throw it back in there She don't put She don't put it Back in like a Ziploc To make sure It don't get freezer burnt or wait, like, wait, hold on. Hold, yeah. Hold, hold on. Hold on. Uh, but, what are you talking about? Like, it's just raw chicken in the... Yeah. No. She just, she just throw it back in there, back in the wrapper. Like, what? I'm like, babe, why do you do so that? Like, so, why? like, on that little plastic cup, on the little plastic table? I mean, yeah. uh, cup? I mean... Fuck. Like, the little container it comes in, right? Plate. Yeah. Fuck, I couldn't say... What the fuck? I couldn't say plate. Yeah. <laughs> I was stuck. <laughs> uh, on the plate? Yeah. And she just, bro, that shit's gonna no. taste like. No, like, all right, like, if she unthaws the chicken, right? She it, It's still, like, in the packaging, right? And she only used half half of that. And she cooks it. But she puts, she, she like, just puts it nonchalant, whatever, back in the freezer. And she don't put, like, a Ziploc bag. She don't put, like, she don't take it out of the wrapper completely and put it in, like, a Ziploc bag nope. and save it for later. She just puts it back in there. Randomly. So what? Because okay, so we get our chicken from like like uh like, like Sam's Club. Like a, we get we get it. So it's a bag. So I just take right. what I need. Boom, put that close the bag back up. Nah, but you guys get your chicken from where? From like Stater Brothers. Okay, so it comes butcher. it comes like it comes on a on a, on a um, is it come on the on the it low? comes in like a uh like in a like in a like a paper bag type texture. Like a thing, like oh, so you guys get it. From we get the, it from a butcher. Oh yeah, you guys get it from the meat shop, like yeah. from, from a set of Okay, mm-hmm. so it comes in that bag. Yeah. Okay, so okay, I see what you're saying. So she just throws a bag in there. Yeah, she just wraps like she she kind of like folds just puts, it and folds put it, it and put it back. Yeah, because like, that chicken's gonna take like a freezer burn. Like I don't like. Why do you do that? Like I like when I'm about to when I'm about to make food. Like and I know I'm I'm not about to cook yeah. all of it. I. You know, separate the other shit, and then I get a freezer Ziploc bag, and then I zip it back yeah, up, and throw yeah, it back in the freezer. Yeah. She don't do that shit. Oh, uh, shit, she like, hum. Yeah. 
I don't know, see how. I mean, she cooks like a couple days later, but I'm just like. But still, that shit tastes like freezer. Exactly. I'm just like, bro, like, why do you do that? Like, yeah. I can't. I don't understand it. Like, and I let her do her thing because she the one that buys the groceries. You know, I pay all the bills and the rent. Yeah. But I'm like, why the fuck do you do that shit? Like, that shit, mm. it pisses me off. I'm sorry, baby. Like, I got to put you on blast, but shit. Yeah. Like, it is what it uh. is. That's that, but that's one of my big, okay. my biggest pet peeves with her. Yeah, now Lydia, her shit is like when we first, when she first moved in, and I'm we're in this room, right? And this is my side of the bed. That's her side of the bed, and we're getting ready to go somewhere. And she, I seen her do that. And I said, "Why do you do that for?" And she's like, "What do you mean? I've been doing this all my life." I said, "You don't fucking get to and do this. <laughs> Give it to your other hand and do this." And she's like, "Why? Why would I do all that if I could do it with one hand?" I said, "Your hand's cramping, like." Me, per- I mean, I, may- maybe because she has short hands, but <laughs> let me see. So like, it's like, and then, nah, bro, you're struggling. That's the wrong. You way feel to me? Do you're it. struggling doing this. Like uh-huh. you get in here, <laughs> but you not get. You not get un- under pit. You, I guess if you get it from the bottom, but still, it, like it's easier just. Yeah, to switch hands. I don't know. That's weird. <laughs> she, yeah, I know. I told her that's fucking weird. Yeah, I can't. I, I can't even be in a in a in a in a in the bathroom when she's doing it. It pisses you off. Oh, and the other thing that pisses me off when they use your deodorant. Oh, really, bro? I almost yeah, fucking my girl. I almost my killed her the other day. I asked her why. I was like, babe, that's a men's deodorant. Why are you using a men's deodorant? She what did said, she tell you? She said in Colombia we use men's deodorant. Well, Lydia tells me it's like it, look, it, it works better than the girls. I said, well, then you'll get your own. Exactly. You get your own. Exactly. Don't use my shit. I said, uh, what if I use your toothbrush? Uh, it's, it's different. No, it's not. No, it's not. It's the same fucking shit, bro. But I'm gonna cut the cameras and come back real fast. Uh. All right, yeah, but it's been it, it, it <laughs> just having just their married life is crazy. Yeah, yeah. Shout out my boy Gaspar, man. That's the homie from work, man. Shout out, shout Miss out you, to my boy. Shout out to them. Shout out to everybody that's been on the lives. If you guys watch the podcast, watch. Shout out to you guys. Um, yeah, if you want to come on the podcast, don't don't hesitate. Don't, to hesitate. Ask, don't be scared, man. I'm gonna have to. Man, we had some guests coming, was supposed to come through, didn't happen. But it's all good. It's all good. It's all good. But, so, we have two, it should be two or just one? Question of the week. Um, yeah, we can just, we can do just one. Just one. Okay, yeah. what's your biggest pet peeve? Yeah, what's your biggest pet peeve? And man? it could be, if you're, if you're married, or you have a, a girlfriend, boyfriend, what's your biggest pet peeve or... How can I put it? Your biggest pet peeve of your boyfriend or girlfriend, yes. or just in life, period. Mm-hmm. So hit, you know, write it down in the comments, uh, and we'll we'll discuss it on the podcast. Yes. Uh, so we did. Uh, I did. We we had a. Uh, we we didn't talk about it, but when we had, what's your what's your safe word? Oh yeah. A lot of people uh, agree with you, right? And they said, "Stop it." <laughs> <laughs> one of was one of them was like, "I'm gonna kill you." Uh-huh. Like, oh, the goddamn, what the fuck is going? Go, what's going on? <laughs> but a lot of people agree with you, and they said, uh-huh. "Stop." Yeah. So uh, I guess I don't really have a like. We don't like how no, you, you said. Didn't give a safe word, did you? I didn't because I don't have one. You wouldn't just like. I, I mean, I guess I would say uh, like uh, ramen or something. Oh, okay. Ramen. Yeah, that's mm-hmm. a, it's a say. Because we both safe like word. ramen, so if I say ramen, she like what ramen? Yeah. So I was like, damn, we got spiderwebs, but that's from from the fucking oh, <laughs> from the Halloween, Halloween special. <laughs> yeah, the Halloween special. I was like, god special. damn, I had to clean. Yeah, but all right. Um, so a lot of people uh, actually agree with you. A lot of people are really liking our our content. So uh, make sure you guys are tapping in with us. <laughs> Shout out to my boy Josue, man. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck that nigga just said to me. Tell Jose, I need it's, him. I need him to go in um uh, and, and fix my in laws' house. The plumbing is real shit, man. Fuck, bro. It's hey, terrible. Man, if you heard that, Josue, man, you got some you got some work to do. Yeah, man. you got some work, man. Got some work. It's um, right down the street. Down too. the street, yeah. You still live right there? Yeah. No. Well, his uh his coworker. 
his oh, coworker, well. the person that he employs, man. He oh, well, right tell your coworker street. to go down the street and uh, fix that shit for me. Yeah, man, you got some plumbing. We got some plumbing issues, man. Come handle that. Yeah, but guys, it's coming to an end. Appreciate you guys, really do. Yeah, um, man. what I was thinking, bro, because those shirts, we're oh. gonna have to eat the cost. <sighs> we're gonna have to take it. But yeah. oh, that's I mean, gonna be low key. I'm already ready to move on to the new. Yeah, one. I think those will kind of we could give them for our guests. Yeah, for for all the guests who want to come in on the podcast, yeah. we got shirts ready for y'all, man. The next one is yeah. gonna be crazy. Yeah, the, the next, next one, one we have to have like a photo shoot and a video yeah. or some shit. Like it has to be crazy. Yeah, we can. We gonna we gonna we do have a to photo eat the shoot, cost man. on that. That you know, it, it, it sucks, but we gonna have to eat it. It don't. I don't mind, man. So, um, should we announce it or should we just wait and just give it like a? So we should make we should we should announce the um, I would say the the logo that we have because we've been sitting on it for a while. We've been sitting on that logo for a while. Yeah, and that's that's a logo that my boy AB came up with. Man, it's one of the most sickest designs I ever seen. It's original, but it's also. Where we come from is where where, you grew, like where we grew up. Yeah, I mean, like the era, the era that we grew up, we were born in. So yeah, maybe he came he came hard with that one. So, so we got to debut that one soon. Yeah, it, it, we just gonna let you guys know that it's gonna be it's a '90s theme. Yes, and if you were if you you know anything about the '90s, uh, I don't even know. I'm gonna just cut this because nobody's in here. But I want to see when that when that when they came when they came out. Yeah, your boy Josue said he got he got time, bro. All right. Oh uh, shit, I'll be probably free next week. Yeah, around sure. Thursday. Yeah, Josue, man, if you listening to this, man, make sure you tap in with my boy AB. He'll let you know when you, when to come through, man. Uh. Um, but the the reason why we can't when I get what I. Hold on, let me get there. <laughs> So the reason why I, um wow I didn't know it came out that what's wow. that it came out in 1983 oh the 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 original created created in 1993 by a comic book so it's not really us well shit no nah, that's more <laughs> of our era that's when we grew up but. Yeah, but this, but yeah. that I mean, I watched this with my brother. My me and my brother used to always watch this. It was a cartoon, and I think I'm gonna have another one, another ninety. I think we're gonna have two nineties ones because I don't I don't know. I'll tell you after the podcast because I don't wanna. Mm-hmm. But I have we have we me and my brother watched this two these two cartoons back to back. One of my one of my geckos is actually named um uh, a character in the, one of those uh, on cartoons, but. This this is gonna be sick. It's gonna be a nineties theme. It's gonna be crazy. And the front is gonna I can give you the front is gonna say uh we rock ninety. Ooh. So and then the back is gonna be crazy. But I really want this shirt to be like special because it's like it kinda it's kinda it, like this one that we had, it was like bringing Mark into the podcast, but yeah. this one is like all right, we're we're like we're we're together, we're a team. Yeah. Um so I I actually want to make that logo like, this one. like that, you know uh-huh. what I'm saying? Because that's what I, even though that like I'm not. If you tell me anything about the thing, I'm be like I don't really know. But I grew up watching it, right? So, and it's like the artists that make this, and I'm gonna give you the artist because we gonna have, we have to shout them out. Yeah, man, he he we'll, snapped on this. We we'll have to shout them out because yeah. I, I'm not really like again like my ass is dyslexic as fuck. <laughs> So I'm gonna butcher his fucking name, but I'm gonna have Mark right here. Oh shit! That's yeah, Riz Riz Quartet, Riz Quartet. Like you know, I'm gonna tag him on this. Yeah, man. but if you guys want to go, all oh, right. Yeah, Riz Quartet. I'm gonna tag him on Instagram and on my everything. I'll put his l- link down below. If you guys want a fucking um a logo done, go hit him up, man. This guy's nice. been doing his. Yeah, I just gave him the idea. I said, I and I only gave him. I said, I, I gave him. I, I told him, I was like, I want the same picture, but I want one red, one blue, 
I didn't even ask him to put the bun in, bro. I didn't even ask him to put the bun. Yeah, he did all that. He did all that, bro. Damn. So I was like, oh shit! Yeah. Like he got he he did he he did this this one too. Mm-hmm. He did a couple for me again. Another one for the one that we have on the podcast page. So make sure you guys are tapping in, guys. Make sure you guys are tapping in. But it's gonna be crazy, man. It's gonna be crazy. But again, guys, coming to an end. Uh, this I think this is one. I think today I had a lot of fun yeah, talking man. about surviving. It was a good podcast. Talking today, about man. you know fucking red Shout flags. <laughs> this time we didn't talk about sex, but probably next one we'll <laughs> next talk about one. sex. Um, so if you guys don't want to watch, uh, want to hear us, I mean watch us, but you guys want to hear us, you guys driving, and you guys can't watch us. We're on Apple Podcasts and Spotify. Make sure you guys tap in with us. Uh, um, if you don't follow me on Instagram, it's ABQMPR. If you don't follow me on TikTok, it's ABQMPR underscore PR. If you don't follow the In The Woods page on Instagram, it's a, uh, In The Woods Pod. If you don't follow it on TikTok, it's AB, uh, AB, uh, In The Woods Pod. Mm-hmm. Make sure you guys are tapping in. We're trying to get that going. Yeah, if you don't follow me, it's IMX Good. It's all in one word on Instagram and Snapchat, man. Tap in with us, man. We dropping new content every week, so we keeping y'all up to date on the most on the most shit that we talk. Yeah, we talk about you know. Um, what I'm you know. So make sure you tap in with us, man. Yeah. So um, I also uh, if you don't, I guess I think I am gonna make my Facebook page the End of Woods page officially. So I'm gonna put that shit down below too. So if you guys want to go and follow that too, it will help us out a lot. Um, so yeah, shout out to Dark Kid, man. We we want you on the podcast, yeah. man. Come on by, man. Next week, book us right now. We about to we about to book you right now. Yeah, man. We need you on the podcast, Yo. man. He's a musician, man. Oh we need yeah, you on here. But um, last week. We had the tank. Well, not last week. Was it last? Yeah, it was last week. Yeah, like a week ago, we had the tank fight. That was amazing. So, make sure you guys are tapping in without all on you. Make sure you guys subscribe, like, hit the notification notification button because that helps with the algorithm. And I'm faded as fuck. I'm <laughs> yeah. tipsy, bro. We had a real good podcast. Yeah, we today, had a good man. podcast. Good drinks, man. Yeah. And uh, make sure you guys are locking in with us, man. Make sure you guys are tapping in, but. Like we always say, guys, always stay blessed. Be blessed. One love. Peace.